<laughs> Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> it's our last day in Mexico or last full day they like how I tried to scare him and he still scared me yeah huh? leave me alone <laughs> The sun is coming out, or at least we hope it is. Meanwhile, look at this view. Not a single thing is ruining it. Oh, but there is that. Why don't you give me Spanish 101? Presa. Oh. Blueberry. Mora. Ora. Mora. Mora. So Richard has been just tormenting me because he really wants me to learn Spanish and it's, my brain just isn't ready for it. La mora es fantástico. Big y delicioso. Honeydew is so good. Mm -hmm. Como se dice honeydew in Espanol? El melon. El melon. Mm. There's no way to distinguish between different melons. Si. Naranja or Really? Oh, I was talking. <laughs> well, cantaloupe no bueno. No, no bueno, papi. Don't waste your time. I'm gonna try it. I do not like papaya, so I'm gonna give it another shot. Mm -hmm. Papaya. Papaya is better. Papaya is better with lime. No, papaya reminds me of this. It smells like dirty feet. <laughs> My feet? You said it. I'm still really having a hard time looking at the, the, the lens, you guys. I just want to look at me. Don't you just want to look at me too? Oh, you are just looking at me. Richard hates me right now. So Richard, what are we doing right now? We had to come to the hotel after we ate breakfast. Yeah. We're savage like that. I'll give you one guess where we're going. You don't even know. Don't even try to guess. We are going downtown. We're gonna do a little barter in Oh, is that what we're doing? See? What are we gonna barter? We are going to barter everything. No, not everything. I don't know if we find something. For nuestra casa, porque gustamos muchos colores, colores, colores. You know, you never know. You never know.
So you guys, if you're in Puerto Vallarta, this is the amphitheater that I'm going to be performing at later next week. <laughs> maybe, maybe not, you'll never know. Maybe that'll be a thing. I'll talk about this when I'm really YouTube famous. And I'll be like, you guys, I'm going to be performing at that Puerto Vallarta place. I'm going to be speaking about making your dreams come true. So we found the tourist destination in Puerto Vallarta. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Da, 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 da. El Starbucks. Establishment that is Starbucks is that you can literally find it anywhere, like almost anywhere in the world. There could be nothing, and then there'll be a Starbucks, which is pretty cool but also pretty weird because we're in Puerto Vallarta and I'm sure there's way better coffee than Starbucks, but here we are getting coffee for Ricardo and a uh, mug for my mom. The, the beauty of beauty of uh, American business, right? Oh man, take a few days off and oof, I'm out of breath walking up these stairs. I'm gonna take a little break and explore the sights a little bit more. I'll, I'll be back if anything exciting comes up. Hope you're having as much fun as we are. Nado. Es una serpiente. Okay. Me explico. Tienen tienen diferentes uh, sí. eh, figuras. Por ejemplo, este oh. es una estrella. Oh, okay. Esa es una estrella. Uh, okay, esto. Es el maíz, la oh, planta del maíz, ¿sí? Entonces, hay diferentes rosas. Mm, ok, esto es una vela, significa la luz, ¿sí? Ahora, uh, hay una que tenía un búho. ¿Qué es eso? Este es un águila. Oh man, we just had the most amazing time in this tequila shop. 
Um, I barely speak Spanish and Richard and I were trying these awesome tequilas and I fell in love with this beautiful bottle and the woman who was selling them to us, she and I totally worked together and we almost convinced Richard to let us buy it. But he said that we had too much tequila at home so I'm gonna get to drinking some tequila when we get home so the next time we come back, there are no excuses. I also got one of my favorite candies from when I was growing up. Peanut butter marzipan, I'm so excited. Oh, it's upside down, peanut butter marzipan. So, uh, we're headed back to the hotel now, the resort, and we're gonna enjoy our last evening here. Yeah, okay, bye, taxi. It's our last night here, and we are about to have our third dinner. I'm not even joking. It's our third dinner. So we're gonna go to Casa Grande because we want guacamole. And the weirdest thing is we have not had a lot of guacamole this entire trip and I'm really angry about it. So we're gonna have our weight in guacamole now. <laughs> Bitches run into the guacamole. Are we eating all the guacamole? Si. Y, no, mira. Show me the can, show me the can. Our server, his name is Angel. He tries to upsell us for like lobster and all this stuff and I said, no, Paul doesn't want lobster. I said, all he cares about is guacamole. All right, so. He brings us the guacamole and all the three different sauces. All of a sudden, out of dim lighting, an angel appears with another bowl of guacamole. And I said, You really are an angel. And then he had two margaritas waiting for us. But um, chink. And there it is. All that guacamole. Stop eating it. No. <laughs> Do you want me to roll you out of here? Yeah. We're about to get rowdy at the tequila bar. Rowdy! You guys, I found where Richard worked when he visited here. Secrets out. Yeah. <laughs> Richard, I told them that that's where you worked when you lived here. Yeah. 